Main event time on NWA Championship Wrestling from Hollywood. A night that this man has waited quite a while for. Handpicked by the legendary Percy Pringle III. Is this the night that Sean Ricker realizes his destiny? TK, the gravy train is pulling into the station, and Adam Pierce is going to hop aboard. And I think we might just see a new NWA World Heavyweight Champion crowd tonight. And look at the legend at ringside, Percy Pringle III. Big town atmosphere right here. for the official announcement, but look at this. Wrecker already trying to lay claim to the coveted goal. This is your championship wrestling from Hollywood main event of the evening. It is a one fall contest for the NWA World Heavyweight Championship. Rick comes to referee. Introducing first, being accompanied to the ring by his manager, Percy Pringle the third. on the line. Quite frankly, it doesn't get any bigger than this on this program, James. No, it doesn't. You know, I have a, I have a little bit of beef with Adam Pierce because of his issues that he's had with the family stone. But tonight, I have a feeling there's going to be a, a change in the wind. There you see what it's all about. The sweet Charlotte, as the champ calls it, the 10 pounds of leather and gold, and it's up for grabs tonight. Champion looks in great shape. Challenger looks in phenomenal shape as well. And I'll tell you what, TK, I'm excited. The people are excited. There's Sean Ricker, the big bad gravy daddy in the ring. Percy Pringle on the outside. One of my faves here at the NWA. But then you got the scrap daddy, Adam Pierce. I mean, this is just unbelievable. I'm loving this right here. Two of my faves right here going at it. Look at these two, nose to nose. Yes, I'm excited as well. I hope you fans watching at home are as excited as we are. Oh, and what a show of disrespect there by the challenger. As he, Sean Ricker right there did. Put him on notice, TK. Put him on notice. Well, you get what you pay for there. And look at now the champ all over him in the corner. Folks, there's nothing in sports as exciting as a heavyweight title bout. And this is what it's all about here tonight, the title on the line. That's right, we got two men in this ring who are not afraid to break the rules. Oh, that's what you call a receipt. Hey, that's not fair. Is that a sign of a true champion? And the champion takes him up and over. You saw there, 
head official Rick Knox saying it was the momentum of the strike that took him over again. There's the over the top rope disqualification rule not in effect there in that exchange. Well, that's why I love both these guys, James. You know, both these guys, like I said, not afraid to break the rules. Both these guys ready to do what's necessary or accept a... When Adam Pierce does it, he gets cheered. When Sean Ricker does it, well, he gets booed. Well, and as they say, James, fools rush in. Ricker went on the outside to try and regroup, but apparently it's not going to pay off. The champ is biting him, pulling out all the stops tonight with the title on the line. Well, I think Adam Pierce knows the title is in jeopardy. He's traveled the world defending that title, and I don't think he's met a challenger who is as good as Sean Ricker is right here, right now. I agree. Sean, this might be the biggest match of Sean Ricker's life. But why is Adam Pierce? He's stupid going on the outside. I mean, come on. He well, can't count it out. Well, Pierce, I don't think he would really mind if he got counted out. The title can't change hands that way. Ricker really needs to be leery of the count. Get him back in the center of the ring where he can try and pin the man or force him to submit. The only way he can gain the title tonight. That's right. That is the champion's advantage. And Adam Pierce knows it full well. He can sit outside the ring brawling all day long if he wants. The champion looks great right now. Hello, oh, look at that. The balance, the agility into that's going to do it. History about to be made. No, only a count of two. Now remember, guys, Adam Pierce, he has a bad neck. That's why he's on his last ride. Sean Ricker knows that, of course, going into this matchup. And I think, I'm sure, that Percy Pringle and Sean Ricker have devised a strategy. A strategy to take the title away from Adam Pierce, And I think it's going to be about going after the injured neck. Well, we often talk about how the champion has a bullseye all over him. So many people gunning for that title. But his neck certainly has a bullseye as well. And that is something that the challenger is trying to exploit. He's flirting with disaster here, though. You can't get disqualified. Got to be careful. That's right. Sean Ricker needs to keep his cool, keep his wits about him. Adam Pierce is as good as they come. That's why he is the NWA World's Heavyweight Champion. But for how much longer? How, how can the champ keep holding on? Define the odds. You talk, oh, the leg drop again attacking the neck. Let's talk about the one last ride. The champion has been traveling coast to coast and to the cover now. Only a count of two. The champ has been de defending that title all over the nation, all over the world. How long can he keep this up? He is a battle-tested, but has got to be a weary champion. But that's a brutal travel schedule. He's faced tough opponents. you got to think he's worn down. He's probably not going into this match at 100%. Talk about, talk about wrestling with an injury, James, especially when the stakes are so high. Well, you know... You you hope adrenaline is your friend, which looks like Adam Pierce has a lot right now. Yeah, he's got that in spades. What a seesaw matchup main event. Title on the line here, but there's the athleticism. Up and over the top, into the power slam. The challenger at the top of his game and almost takes it home again. Sean Ricker has that camel clutch cinched in. And look at Percy Pringle on the outside, urging, telling Adam Pierce, give it up. Give it up, Pierce, give it up, quit now. And right now, in control of the matchup, again, right now at this moment, is the challenger looks supremely confident as he knows it's only a matter of time, and it would have been if that arm dropped. But the champion, look at the eyes of the champion, trying to get back to his feet. One more time, one more ride, one more title defense. Can he do it? Adam Pierce right there was staring a hole right in the eyes of the legend Percy Pringle and with everything he had he took Sean, Ruck, uh, Sean Ricker up and then he took him down. Could this James be the window of opportunity with that counter that the champ needs to turn things in his favor? He's sure wasting a lot of time he needs to go over and, and take care of Sean Ricker pin him do it do whatever you need to do he's taking too much time. Well, I don't think he's wasting time as much as that's a credit to how much Ricker, the challenger, has taken out of the tank of the champion. Well, Sean Ricker now again on the offensive with Pierce on the top rope. Dangerous position, but look at that. Pierce just shoved him down, and now here comes Ricker again. Oh. What? Wow, what a heads-up counter there by the champion. And now he's got the challenger in a compromising position. What a physical world title match we're seeing here. Both guys came tonight to fight. They are bringing everything they got. Oh, look out here. Is it going to be a suplex from the top? Yes! That's a long way down, plummeting to the 
the center of the ring and are the championship aspirations of Ricker falling as well. Listen to this crowd. Well, the crowd appreciating the action here. They can sense, they can sense, they can feel it. This is big time title match atmosphere. And I gotta tell you, I still think that title is very much in jeopardy. Ooh. Double count here, James. If neither man can get up, we won't have a winner. Uh -oh. I think Percy Pringle's gonna have a heart attack out there. What an atmosphere, folks. This is why you gotta be here live when the title's on the line in our main event. It doesn't get any better than this. Who's gonna get the advantage now? The backdrop by the champion. Well, Pierce back in control. You know, Sean Rooker, he pulled the gravy train into the station, but he's trying to pull it out with that NWA title. And right now, Pierce is saying, uh-uh. Uh-oh. Think he's gonna introduce him to his friend. Mr. T. Buckle here. That's like TK. <laughs> Took him all the way down to the basement there. And I'll tell you what, Adam Pierce, you can see the intensity, the drive. He doesn't want this last ride toward the end. Wait, wait, what is he thinking are you doing? What is he gonna do? Trying to slingshot him there into the corner, now drops the elbow, calls the audible there into the cover, only a count of two. What happened there, Sean Ricker trying to hold on, he knew it was coming, he didn't want to get tossed into the middle of the ring, he did everything he could, Adam Pierce did get all of it, but great, you're right, audible, bam, power slam, covers, two, no, oh, boy was that close. Returning the favor from Ricker's power slam earlier on in this championship contest, where does the champ find this? Oh, he's calling for the pile driver here. That could do it. A gallant attempt here by the challenger, but it's going to be all for naught if Pierce can lock him in the pile driver. Pierce now. Now Ricker cuts him off back and forth. These two incredible warriors go Larry on top. He caught him. Go for the cover. Put him away, champ. Oh! I can't. <laughs> Sean Ricker, that's ring awareness. Putting that foot up on the rope, it saved his life. And I saved, think it saved his chance of becoming the next champion. Oh, but this look at this. Pringle. Dangerous situation for Pringle up there with Pierce. He's trying to, he's trying to buy his man some time. Oh! Well, the sacrifice play there. But look at the time, as you mentioned, that it has bought the challenger to try and recover here. But I don't think it's going to work. Sean Ricker, he's got to duck. He's got to duck it. Oh, Randy Train drops oh. it. Pulls into the station, as you said. The title going to be around the waist. No! The train got derailed at the last split second. Unbelievable. TK, I'm losing it over here. Unbelievable. This one living up to the billing. When the title's on the line, these two are giving everything that they have in their bodies, in their minds. What's it going to take to get the win? <laughs> At this point, I have no idea. He need, he's already pulled out every trick from under his sleeve, in the bag, in the hat. And listen to the crowd. Yeah, listen to the fans chant. This is wrestling indeed. Percy Pringle now. He's got the shoe. We've talked about that he's got soul. But he hit his own man. Schoolboy cover. The champ defends. I can't believe this. I can't believe it! I'm out of here! Oh. Unbelievable title matchup right there. And Here is your winner and still NWA World's Heavyweight Champion, Scary Unbelievable as James Morgan is stormed out of the broadcast area here. We talked about that Percy Pringle might be the difference maker to help Ricker gain the goal. But in the end, it was just the opposite. In the end, the, the interference from Percy Pringle back by oh, Wait a second. What is this? The family stone has made their way to the ring. Big nasty Eric Watts. Well, now we know where James Morgan was going. Well, a post-match attack from the family stone. 
I like Rooker and, and I like Morgan and all that stuff, but I, I, I can't condone this. Oh, don't do it. You're an Augie by Big Nasty, and it was just that. Nasty, the champion, just endured a heck of a matchup. Now Morton Lipschitz is here. He's getting exactly what he deserved, and he deserves it. He has hit me. He hit my friend Percy Pringle, and he's, it's over. He's getting what he has coming. Like a bunch of buzzards circling here, picking at the kill. Talk about opportunistic. Now Stu Stone saying that thing is tell oh look at that. Tell him Adam Pierce that the end of your world's title coming to Hold the on. Stone. Here comes Cole Cabana though. Here comes the cavalry. Cole Cabana walks softly, carry a big stick, coming to the aid of his longtime rival, but you can't question the respect between Pierce and Cabana. No, well, you can't. These two men clash for the NWA World Heavyweight title in a classic. Hey, fellas, what did I miss? Oh, give me a break. We talked about the bullseye being on the back of the champion, and it looks like it just got a little bit bigger. It did. It got a whole heck of a lot bigger. The family stone clearly gunning for the NWA World Heavyweight title held by Adam Pierce.